Hey guys, Mike here from Benya Outdoors. This video is a little bit unique because it is my honeymoon. I convinced her to go fishing instead of doing anything else fun. So hopefully we catch some fish to make the trip worth it. And here guys, as I found a little shallow area with a lot of vegetation on the bottom, but the vegetation doesn't come all the way to the surface. So rather than try to dink and dunk this all with a worm and try to cover this whole area, I'm using a swim bait Kitech Easy Shiner to be specific and I'm working my way through this area slowly ruling this just fast enough to stay right in the middle of the water column hoping that I can find some fish and then start picking it apart with a Senko or a little bit more finesse slow down type of technique. This is the kind of area that you want to try using your Senkos. It's the kind of area you want to try fishing your weedless baits because your Regor crank baits, things like that, are gonna get hung up in this stuff. The idea is to cast up against any type of cover you can. Just drop your baits right in on the edge of, like for example, what I'm looking at right here, these are lily pads. I'm just gonna drop it right in front of them. This is where the high vis line comes in handy. I can reel my line and I can see if a fish hits it long before I could feel it. I'm going to try casting right up into the shade line and see if there's anything waiting for me in there. And then I'm going to get out of this area. And there it is, guys. Come on, baby. <laughs> you see him? That is a four pounder. You gotta go a little spot right here. There's one. Yep. Come here, buddy. What? Junebug Sanko. Come here. Come here, buddy. Got him. Oh. Come on. Oh, what is that? I got another one. Where the hell is that freaking thing? Okay, dude. See why I like these frogs? Just watch this shit. See that fish jump right there? Yeah. Do you see that? Yeah. Do you see it suck it down?
You hear all that popping? That's bluegill. Yep. Bluegill eating off the surface. Nope. That's what happens when a bluegill eats off the... Uh... Oh, no, I'm going to get him out of here, though. Shit. Oh, come here. Oh, this is going to suck. Oh. It's got me tangled. I think so. Yep, I got him. No, little guy. Yeah. Sometimes you got to fish in the crappier areas. As soon as you give up, dude, I'm going to let you go. Stop it. Jesus. That little guy was aggressive. That fish, I'm not even kidding you. It's in six inches of water right here. Got him. Yep. Wow. Ugh. Ugh. What did I hook into? Holy shit. What did I do? Get a weed in him, too? Ha <laughs> ha! I finally caught one on a frog. Look at that shit. Oh, god damn it. Come here, buddy. Look at that, guys. First frog fish. Awesome. Got him. Yep. Shit. Oh, this ain't gonna be good. This ain't gonna be good. Shit. Yeah, it's fine. It's just. No, <clears throat> oh, come on. Come on, buddy. No, it's caught up in the freaking weeds. The problem is it. <laughs> oh god the problem isn't the fish it's the freaking weeds there's a fish in here somewhere or there was he caught me in the weeds and then I was trying not to go over the goddamn waterfall I thought I had my, see I always have my anchor out, so I can throw it down. That sucks, I had one too. You wish your what? You gotta sit with your feet up. You gotta put your feet up. <laughs> Are you for real? <laughs> God damn. What do you think, babe? 
Look at that, guys. The toughest bite out here. Why? You want a divorce? What do you think of that? What do you think of that? I was trying to pre... I wasn't even watching my pole. <laughs> oh, that was awesome. I'm off roading. All right, fine. You give me that wifely look. Fine. I'm fishing my way out though. I wasn't recording. Oh, what the fuck? Hey guys, I'm gonna wrap it up right here. I want to start by thanking you all for coming on my honeymoon with me. Eight hours on the water, catching six bass. Pretty good honeymoon as far as I'm concerned. I want to wrap up this video, but also wrap up the season. This is gonna be my last video of 2020. I do want to thank everyone who liked my videos, everyone who gave me a subscribe. I really appreciate all the positive feedback that I've gotten on this channel, and I will be back in the spring. I'm actually going to be making some beginner series videos, literally breaking everything down from what kind of poles you need to what kind of baits you need, all the way up to using a bait caster and more advanced techniques. So, Look for that sometime this spring. I'm going to be recording those over the winter when, you know, I got nothing else to do. And then I'll be releasing the entire series weekly come this spring. I am going to be still doing videos in the fall. My son Matthew is actually going to be hunting this year. And I decided it would be really cool to follow him around with a camera as he learns the ropes of deer hunting. And, you know, maybe I can teach you guys something that you didn't know as well so for now this is going to be the end of the fishing series and the beginning of the deer hunting series hopefully you guys like it and as always please like and subscribe and let's get out there and catch more fish by the power vested in me by the state of vermont the voters in the town of brandon <laughs> i now pronounce you husband and wife please kiss. Oh.